here and welcome to a new video on my channel I'm so happy that you decided to click on this video and spend a couple minutes of your day with me thank you today I'm gonna be reviewing a very exciting product it's right here I cannot wait to show you guys but before I get into anything I do want to let you know that this video is sponsored by Dyson and when they reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to review their new insane crazy tool that's coming out I was like well what is it and they were being really secretive about it because they didn't want it to like get out they didn't want people to know what it is they kind of wanted to have this big exciting launch so we decided to set up a little meeting in Los Angeles at the YouTube space so I went to see what it was so I show up and when they showed us the product I got so excited because I've been waiting for so long for somebody out there to come up with a way to curl your hair with minimal heat damage because I don't understand why in 2018 we're still using hot metal rods to curl our hair it's like basically every time you curl your hair you damage it a lot so without further ado here it is this is the dyson air wap and today i'm going to be reviewing and talking about everything that's in this box and what it does and what it comes with um i only got to play with it a little bit so today's going to be the first time i actually do my whole head with it so i'm just gonna go through everything and let you know what are my honest opinions on this particular product i'm gonna read off the box the things that it's supposed to do because it's going to be much better than me trying to explain it um, so it's called Coenda to Curl. Basically, this is their hero product. That's the main wand, um, and it has all these interchangeable heads. Uh, but the main technology that they developed with this is a continuous flow of air forms around the barrel, attracting hair to its surface, creating voluminous curls and waves without extreme heat. It also protects hair from extreme he uh, heat damage. Um, Coenda airflow attracts hair to the surface of the brush, then propels air along the hair strands to mimic a stylist uh, blow dry technique. So it comes in this faux leather box, which I think is just so nice and luxurious. So we're gonna open her up. Um, it comes with some instructions. I'm gonna take those off for now. And this is what it looks like inside. It has your wand and all your different heads. And I'm just gonna go over every. And today I'm gonna show you a couple of these. But you're kinda gonna get the idea of what it's supposed to do, how it works, and all that good stuff. So I'm gonna take a section of hair. And now my hair is not as damp, so I'm gonna have to wet it a little bit. So the first thing I'm gonna try is the soft smoothing brush. And as you can see, it has these little uh, pink things at the end so it doesn't quite pull at your hair. Um, they also have this one, which is meant to be for more thick, coarse hair. Um, I think this one's gonna be good for me. So this is the wand, I'm gonna pop it in. So right here you have your on and off button, your different um, airflow settings, and then here you have your different heat settings. So as you can see, it is all nice and smoothed out and it's very like kind of eerie. And you can make the curl a little bit more if you just kind of do it slower. Um, but yeah, look at that. I'm gonna try to do another section on this side. Yes, I am using a plant mister because <laughs> I don't know where my hair mister went. So we're gonna brush it out. So you wanna start at the root because your ends are usually the one to be dry first. So you're just gonna start at the root and go over it a little bit. We're just gonna smooth out the top area really nicely. So you can see the before and after, like it was really fast to just kind of start. Like I could go out like this, I don't even have to do anything to it. But I think it's just so cool that you can add a little extra um, hand swoop to it and you get that really nice face framing effect. So that's it for this. I feel like this would take me like five minutes to style my whole head and I don't even have to do the swoop. I can just do it straight. So now for the hero product, the stuff that all the commotion is about, um, you just kind of pop it up. I'm gonna do the small barrel and I'm gonna put this in, turn it on and I'm gonna use this on the hot setting first.
And you can feel this with your hand because it doesn't get that hot, which is amazing. You don't need any gloves or anything. And you can kind of move it around. It doesn't get caught or like snaggy anywhere. And once your hair feels dry, you're just gonna turn on the cool setting to lock in the curl. And let's see what happens. Voila! Soft little bouncy curl and the hair is dry. So basically through all these holes you have your air going that way. So it simultaneously dries and curls your hair. So you don't even have to blow dry, you can do it all in one step. Which in my opinion is freaking incredible. I'm gonna grab another section of hair and do the same thing. So I'm gonna turn it on, drop it on the barrel and then let it curl, um, do its own thing. And that's it. Now the curl. I'm gonna try doing a bigger section this time, see what happens. And they're so bouncy and light and fresh. Girl! <laughs> I say there's like a slight learning curve, but I feel like once you practice a little bit and kind of try with pieces more from the back of your hair instead of the front so you don't mess it up, you really can get your hair done really, really fast. Like I'm pretty much done with the side of my head and I can keep going. And I'm using this without any kind of product in my hair. So I did my whole left side and these are the shiny bouncy curls that it created. And it does have like a very lightweight bouncy feel to it. It doesn't kind of feel like a crunchy curling iron. And then if you don't want them so piecey, like I would just kind of take it apart and yeah. I'm gonna do a few more on this side because I feel like it's so fun to watch. This thing is like magic. <laughs> Boom! I'm gonna do one more and then I'm gonna finish my head off camera. What I'm gonna do now is kind of brush it out and it's gonna fall to be these really pretty sort of voluminous waves. Because if you want super crazy curls, you can have them, but I like it more just soft and kind of like Hollywood glam looking. And that's the look, you guys. I didn't use any hair products, any hairspray, any pomades, nothing. It just kind of... That's what it does. Closing thoughts on the product, I am absolutely obsessed with it. I do not see myself ever using a normal curling iron ever again. Um, I love the fact that you can actually touch this while you're curling your hair because it doesn't get hot, so therefore it doesn't extremely damage your hair. Um, I also love the fact that you don't need any gloves. There's nowhere for hair to be caught. Because you know there's been products before that claim to curl their, your hair on its own, but it gets like caught and it's gonna break your hair. This thing doesn't at all. Um, but you still have to kind of learn and be careful with it anyway. Anyway, you know just in case um, what else I love the fact that it comes with all these extensions so if you don't want to curl your hair you can definitely um, do lots with it it also comes with a little uh, blow drying head this one does not work um, as well as like the normal Dyson blow dry but it still works pretty well if that's what you want to do and um, I think that's about it I'm very impressed I really really love this the one negative I have to say well semi negative this is a pretty pricey product and I believe it was 540 I'm gonna put the price right here. Um, when I saw it, I was like, whoa, this is one pricey um, curling iron blow drying tool kit. And I'm personally really excited to never stop using this and especially that I can get my hair done quick and not damage it. Hallelujah Jesus. And yes, it did take me longer to do my hair today because my camera kept dying. As you can see the clock in the back. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, please give it a like because it does help me out a lot. Let me know if you'd like more uh, type of review videos in the future. And on that note, I love you guys so much. Bye!